This will be used as relief throughout the first part of this playthrough. Just get over it. This world was devastated before I was born. Oh. A harsh, oh. place where we hey live guys. in darkness. Shadow Dark right here, and welcome back and to Let's Play Sonic 06. And a happy new no year for you all. I've been... The this is the inevitable part here. <coughs> the, not only the final full character story, but... The action, but... The final of the three main characters are playing paid as now. They come from an and something life. even worse they is this character is the worst no character in all of this entire franchise. Blaze, what's wrong? He's a oh, it's Blaze the Cat. Some, a character whose story has been balls up. Anyway, I'll describe that later. Basically, um, we don't know. Silver is the third character. You may have seen in the opening some of the fights in the games and more. And you've seen it from Silver from um, <coughs> that one mission in Sonic Story, so basically we don't need to go into it. But oh Jesus, I don't really care anymore. This is just game just hurts. Anyway, quite an interesting fact about this is that for th that this year this game turns ten years old. Yeah, this game turns 10 years old today, but, well, not today, but this year. And it's a pretty funny thing that what I like to consider to be the worst thing that this franchise has ever created. I like that feature, at least. That's one of the few good things about Silver the Hedgehog. Like, at the very least, you can hover. Oh, no! No! Oh, you son of a bitch. Right, you know what? Oh, wait, I can't levitate anymore. Oh, no, I can't. Let's just play a game I hit a beta. Head up I go. There we go, screw the system. I can do it too. Oh, it, oh, it already opened up for me. That's... That's absolutely mag- oh! That's absolutely magnificent. Oh! And have fun, a straight on collision with a tornado. See? This is one of those characters in the franchise that could have had potential to be playable. And could have been really good as well, but instead they go ahead and make this garbage and make Silverge not good in any way, shape or form. I mean, don't get me wrong, I want 2016 for the Sonic franchise to be great. I mean, it's the 25th anniversary year of Sonic. And especially for that, it's also the um, 10 year anniversary of this game, technically. So, I want this. Uh, Blaze, what are you doing? Let's see if I can hit it into that. Oh, yeah, I can! It's not doing anything. It's just moving. It's stuck. Can we gentle nudge? Oh. Like everything in Sonic 06, it has to disappoint me. Thank you, life. Thank you. Alright. No. Oh. Nah. Okay, just go. I am way too... I am... I've been drinking already, so... I don't need... Let's have a drink of this. Just to calm the pain. What? Whoa! Ho-ho! <laughs> Did you see that texture? It was flopping all over the place. 
Okay, so that's what it's gonna be, right? Cool. Oh, Blaze! <laughs> Blaze died. So it's quite early on in the year, and oh, ah! oh my God, that was just um um freaking um. If I can play okay. Nope. No! He's dead. Silver is just like pure dead. Right, let's see if I can just. I, w I was wanting, seeing if I could hover across, and then it would have been that I would have been able to make it. But no, I. Oh. When it opens its mouth, that's my okay, let's just use the. Or, you know, because of the game's terrible AI, I could- Oh! 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 Oh, gotta go fast, Silver. <clears throat> Again, random cut fact about Silver, actually. Um, Silver the Hedgehog was originally going to have... have a gem that makes him run faster. Yeah, Silver was yeah, Silver was originally going to be able to run faster, but for whatever reason, they decided to cut it out, which oh my god, that hurt my eyes. Uh, which I think is kind of ridiculous considering Silver needs that extra speed. I mean, look how slow he's running. In levels where you don't want to take like 6 years trying to get to a destination, it's going to be troublesome because you don't want Silver's speed to be just like this. Oh, gotta go fast. It's Sonic the Hedgehog. I mean, seriously, that speed belongs in something else. I mean, Sonic. I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring up another Let's Play here. I know I don't want to do this it's usually because that's not a good idea since I'm not related with him in any way. But I'm gonna talk about Clement's idea for those in his review of Sonic 06. Star Wars The Force Unleashed is a really good game and also really well details what Silver could have been. Like, for example, somebody that can pick up every... Somebody that can just use his force power, I mean, he could use his telekinetic powers in different ways to actually fight against the, um, fight against Iblis's creatures. Or even fight against Eggman's robots and such. Like, you see him do a thing where he picks up, mo where he grabs multiple enemies and then flings them across the room. And then, like, flings them. Why can't I do that? Why can't anybody who plays this abomination do that? Why? Because that would require more effort, that's why. Sonic Team was just kind of just like picking their own asses probably while they were making this game. They didn't know what they were doing. Okay, they come. At any rate, we're going to be replaying all the stages anyway, most of the cutscenes. So I'm going to do the same thing as I did last time. Any cutscene that we've already seen in like Sonic Story or such. Uh, we will not do. If there's any new parts to the cutscene, then yeah, I will give you guys. Uh, we will have to watch it again. Of course, everything else will have to be avoided, considering it's new stuff. But you know, oh, these load times are just really getting on my nerves. Anyway, in the meantime, the episode Mel playthrough was quite fun. Oh yeah, guys. So here we are now with probably the most finished and the most fun playable character in this game, Blaze the Cat. I mean, look at this. Slightly fluent controls. A really awesome double jump. Oh. 
glitches the game. It's really fast, actually. Fast enough. Has this nice lock on attack. That's this really nice lock on attack, actually. You see, for Sonic, this is. For Sonic 06, especially, this is actually pretty good. Oh, are we suddenly playing Sonic? O are we suddenly, suddenly playing Sonic Four? Like there were so many like boost pads and springs all over the place. I really, I want to ask you guys something. You know, once I've done and I've taken a, once I've done with this in episode two and I've taken a nice long break from Sonic to do something else like Portal. What next Sonic game would you guys like to see me do? Like Generations, Unleashed. Maybe Lost World, I don't know. I mean, what would you guys think? Because, I mean, I haven't done too many Nintendo let's, Nintendo game Let's Plays. So anyway, that was Blaze's part finished. Yeah, okay, I'm waiting. You know, this low time wants to be finished by 2016, that would be fine. Despite the fact that it is 2016, so that's the ironic joke. And here we are, we're in an area. <laughs> no, I wanna play as Sil- I wanna play as Blaze! Blaze is good! Well, looks like we now have to play as Silver again. Yay! Anyway, let's talk about my plan. Anyway, while I'm here, I need to talk about my plans quickly for this playthrough so far. Um, so far, I'm gonna try and get this playthrough done. I'm gonna try and get Silver's story completed by at least by at least f February or March, and the game finished late March. So who knows, really, if anything, uh, when the final story is here, you might see a double episode. Oh, it's a fucking tornado. Oh my god. Well, that's almost guaranteed me to not be getting an S rank. If any of you are wondering why Silver is flying, like flapping his arms to fly, Basically, um, that's a way, so... Anyway, let me demonstrate. Look how fast the meter goes down. Oh, wait, wait, watch this. Let's turn around. Watch this. Oh, wait, everyone's dead. There you go. Basically, watch this. Look how fast the meter goes down when that happens. Like, it just drops. Then when I play, when I do the flat... Where did you come from, you fuckboy? And now watch how, like, how low it drops now. See? Yeah, that goes gradually. And of course I'm invincible. And whenever I touch anything it doesn't harm them. Cause I, and I can't even see it. So that's very good game design right there. Oh my god. Everything is falling. We're all doomed. The world is at an end. Where am I? Oh my god, this frame rate is like liquid diarrhea. It is garbage. Alright, well, where am I going? Where am I going? Like, I am actually lost. Oh, no, I'm supposed to go down there. Well, bright story short, we've beaten the first level of silver today. 
I think it's a pretty good time to actually start the 06 playthrough in, uh, <laughs> but I think it was a pretty good to start 06 in January 1st. Because all I gotta do is about like 10 parts, or 10 or 11 parts. And yeah, so basically that's it. That's the first part not really done yet because I know what's after this and it's the boss with what's his face? Dickhead McGee. Iblis, yeah, Iblis. Iblis in his Titan form. And there it is. This giant raging son of a bitch. God, those face animations are so bad. Like, actually, it's just pure garbage. Like, I can't believe it. And there we go, we're now fighting Iblis. Basically, this giant, massive demon fucker who tries to end the world. So it's all fun and games, isn't it? It's all fun and games until somebody gives us their arm. And most likely if I continue playing this game, it'll be me. So, yay. Oh my god. Right, there we go. So we're now fighting Iblis. Uh, basically, the obvious aim is just to pick up shit and just throw it at him. His weak spot is the armored head. Aim for that, Silver. Yeah, and as Blaze just said, the head is his weakness, which I just completely missed. Yay! And there we go. That did that do anything? I wasn't looking at the time, so I don't even remember if it did any if that did anything to him. Oh no, he's trying to throw a giant wafer at me. Well, at least if I remember correctly, that gives me more stuff. No, it doesn't. Okay, it kinda did. That's his head destroyed. A part of his head armor destroyed. The thing is, as many as you already know, that when this son of a bitch goes down, he's not staying down. No! The battle's already started! Look at him. I don't think of an analogy. All right, all right, bro. So <laughs> gets whoa, whoa, there, buddy. Whoa, all right, settle down. <laughs> oh, there we go. He is now flinging that skyscraper at me somehow. Where you go? Where you go? There you go. You massive, big, gigantic, raging idiot. Alright, settle down now. Oh, for fuck's sake, you destroyed the thing I was gonna fling at your face! Stop following me! Oh, you're still gonna do this? Alright. Oh, 
Oh, he's dead. He is just the maddest of dead right now. K. O. Bye bye, bitch bag. See, the one thing I wanted him to do is when he sink into the lava, if he just did like the Terminator 2 thumbs up thing where he just slowly sinks into the lava. Just like in term just like in Terminator. Ah, and an S rank. Well, that wasn't really that difficult anyway. All it really was was just throwing things at his head. Anyway, I think that'll be it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Um, thank you so much for watching this next episode of Sonic 06. Um, feel free to subscribe if you can, if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys in the next episode on to you guys on the next episode next week. Take care. Bye.